My name is David Fredin Silvekors and I am the chairman of the board uh, of ECIC, the European Christian Internet Conference. We are an association that started in the 1990s and promotes cooperation ecumenically in Europe between parishes and different levels of church in regards to questions around the internet and being church online and the, the questions around technology. Uh, this year we are in Cologne in Germany, uh, where we are especially um, looking at the themes around public theology and also of course AI, which is a big theme uh, for everybody this year. I am a vicar in Church of Sweden, which is uh, the Lutheran former state church in Sweden. My position is normally not very digi digital perhaps, but these are, are matters that are important to me as they should be important to everybody, since the internet and, and all of its ramifications are really, really uh, making an impact in everybody's life and also the church's life. And it's very hard to think through these questions in a good way, both theology uh, when it comes to the theology, but also when it comes to what the technology makes possible. And, and find that way between those two areas is really important to me, and that is why I am part of ECIC since a few years back. I think today, um, at least in Sweden, when it comes to Generation Z, the, the, the youngest generation, many of them are today seeking um, more, more safety than the millennials did, the, my generation that were more globe trotters and, and traveling a lot more. Today's young are more into finding what, what is safe, how can I build a, a financially sound career for myself, for my family. So they are more close to home than before. And also existential questions are more pressing today with both the pandemic and war in Europe. So th those are things I, I believe the church has a, a big role to play in, in sharing the gospel, that we have a hope that transcends this world and, and we have a savior that is larger than anything else that we can, can um, meet in during our lifetime here and that we have a hope that is bright for the future, even though things can look dark right now.